everyone, it's Kristen and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. So for today's video, you guys, I had a lot of energy. So I thought this would be a really fun time to get on here and actually do one of these build challenges that I have been wanting to do for so long. So I have seen a lot of the other simmers do the challenge where you have like one home, but every single room in that home is a completely different pack. So I am going to be leaving a link in the description where you guys can find the pack generator that we are going to actually be using um, in today's video. This is by James Turner. And actually, if we go up to the Sims, you can see the random pack generator. Then when you click it, that is actually what we are going to be using to pick the packs for the room. I'm scared. <laughs> Another thing that I want to mention, you guys, I do have face cam that will be starting pretty soon on my channel because I did um, pick one of those up. But okay, so we need to choose which apartment we are going to do this challenge with. So I don't think we are going to be doing the Stone Street, Stone Street apartments because they are only one bedroom, one bathroom. So they are smaller than the Pinecrest apartments where those are two bedrooms, one bathroom. I think we're actually gonna do this one. Now the packs that I really, really do not want is, um, I definitely do not want the Halloween free stuff one or the Christmas one, or, oh my gosh, probably get together just because it's like a little bit dated. Ooh, this is cute. I think I'm just going to add these in for now. These are base games, so I do feel like that's not cheating, right? <laughs> you guys, that is not cheating. Like, this is allowed, right? So let's actually put drywall everywhere. Oh my gosh, we should probably just put in like a base game flooring. I think we just do that, I guess. <laughs> I am so nervous. I hope tiny living stuff. Ooh, okay. I actually think that is a good one. Tiny living stuff pack. The stuff that came in that is really cute, you guys. So I am not mad about it. So we do only have one bed. Oh, we do have the Murphy beds though. Oh, I like this one here. I wonder if we yeah i kind of nervous because this can go so many ways like this can take an awful turn <laughs> oh man i don't know if i'm loving this i'm kind of struggling and i'm pretending you guys that i'm not but i most definitely am <laughs> because i'm trying to figure out if i'm actually allowed oh we're definitely going to need to change out the light oh my gosh we're gonna need to make this for two sims i think we can do that what do you guys think have you guys seen you know some of the other simmers do this challenge before and like how bad am i doing <laughs> oh the candle one wait do we have two candles or add in a little sofa the tall shelf here can we put like a little table what am i doing <gasps> The colors look so nice in here. This is not a build. This is a little bit of a challenge and I am definitely struggling a little bit here. Can we put a book? No. Oh, we can't put it in the bottom. I forgot about that. We got the door that actually you can see through. So that's fine. So we did get the door. We have this cute little desk and we can even add in like this little adorable chair as well. <gasps> That's cute. Okay, it's not bad. I feel like that definitely kind of spruces it up a little bit, but we really don't even have anything. We could put maybe a little desk lamp. Of course, let's do purple. So first bedroom is complete. So next we're gonna be moving on to what I am picturing to build for the kids' rooms. So number of packs and generate our next pack. <laughs> oh my gosh. How am, no, oh my gosh. <laughs> this is like the one room that I did not want to have for this challenge. So um, yes, I am a little bit annoyed. I'm not happy right now. Seriously, I'm shaking. <laughs> There's not even a bed in here. Okay, so apparently this is no longer going to be a bedroom. The only thing is also we do have wallpaper. <gasps> Wait a minute. Wait a minute, when in the world did we get pink, peach, and purple ghost wallpaper? Because now, actually, I am so happy about this. Oh, we have purple. Okay. 
we can have them kind of like holding the curtains. I think we have a little bit of a sh good shot now. So let's do a couple different types of candy. I'm like, is this the party room? Because this was supposed to be the kids room, but there's like no bed and this teddy bear now has no eyes. Our little um, ghost table and chairs. I actually think those are cute to be honest. I just wish we would get maybe like a little bit of an update for like this furniture. Oh, let's do this one. Trying to keep like the colors a little bit, you know, um, mellow. <laughs> Just a little bit. Okay, so then we're going to need to add some pictures. These pictures kind of scare me. Like I feel like they have a haunted story. Yeah, we don't have any, oh, we do have a rug. Oh, we can, let's add this one in. We're just gonna make it maybe a little bit, a little bit smaller. That is horrendous. <laughs> How are you supposed to even make this pack look cute? Those are kind of cute. I do like those. Sometimes I put them like in the bedrooms. This is so embarrassing. Okay, so do we have any new doors? I don't think that we do. Okay, so we can actually get rid of this and we're just going to find a base game door. Okay, so the next room that we are going to be decorating is what is supposed to be the bathroom. You guys, cross your fingers, cross your toes that we are going to be getting something that we can actually decorate. <gasps> yes! So I'm okay with losing it, you know, for that one because we now have city living. Now city living is one of my absolute favorite game expansions in Sims, to be honest. Like I, I just really love this pack and um has everything that we're gonna need oh wait it even has like wallpaper and flooring but i think we'll do that last i think that we're going to go for a nice teal color we have our robot toilet oh wait we do have these a little smaller okay that works um let's use how about um it's fine <laughs> But we do have wallpaper, large, fancy tiles. Okay, this works. Oh, we could do that one. That one does not match, so I mean, why not? I thought this was gonna be a lot better than it actually turned out. <laughs> okay, so next one we are going to be choosing is the kitchen. Now you guys, this one is absolutely terrifying because if we do not get kitchen counters, stove, fridge it is actually going to be you're not going to be able to actually like do anything so um cross dino <gasps> wow okay what better of a freaking pack i thought that we had the brown ones with that or was that cool oh i'm thinking i think i'm thinking of cool kitchen but the good thing is we do have our buffet table we do have the buffet table, you guys. So we do have that going for us and we are gonna be able to actually add in table and chairs as well. We will do like some peachy chairs. Yes, the plant that I love the most. <laughs> to make it a little bit cuter. Okay, that looks cute because we're gonna actually add like, this is one of my all time favorite pictures. I just kind of had to stop using it because um, honestly, I use it too much. Yes, oh my gosh, the kitchen is turning out so cute. Wait, do we have, um, I think let's put maybe this plant here and we can actually put the pink one. Okay, this is all coming together and I guess we could add like just a little bit of extra clutter here. All right, so, oh my gosh, and the little candle, we need that on the table. But I was like making the candles a little bit of a darker color because I do find that it is kind of like hard to see them when they're placed. Okay, do we have any rugs or anything? I guess we could, we can put that one in there. The scenery, oh my gosh, this is just, <laughs> this is turning out so different than what I envisioned. I thought for sure I was gonna be able to do this. Oh my goodness, yes modern wood paneling. Okay, so I think that's what I'm gonna do for these walls. Wait, wow, that was so weird. Wait, what is going on? <laughs> Maybe if I just do, okay, this is so bizarre. Why is it not letting me paint the walls? Okay, let me move that out of the way. 
that is bizarre okay and we're gonna put the brick on the back wall weird guys i think that turned out probably for the best room that we have done um so far to be honest like i feel like this is more of a me build definitely not how i would have done it if i had access <laughs> to everything but i do think this one turned out okay and we do have the last room that we are going to be choosing for the living room and hallway and tiny living stuff okay um i think i'm gonna pick again just because we did already have that one i think that's fair and we have movie hangout okay so we have movie hangout brought up and you guys i actually forgot how like really cool this pack actually is so unfortunately with movie hangout there is no wallpaper or flooring there is doors but we do not actually need any of those so I think we're just going to keep the wallpaper that goes with the kitchen for this one. Um, I think that's fair. Very, very nice. Okay, so what else can we add on here? Okay, so we have this one set up. Next, what we're going to do is I love this sofa. This one always used to be my favorite. And of course, like the little puffs also. I am so aware at how bad this looks, but we're just definitely going to go with it. I can see why this is for sure a challenge and not a challenge that I could win. And we'll put a rug over here to cover up all of our mistakes. So this is the final product. I really want you to try this out if you haven't already because it is definitely a challenge. So when you walk into the home, you guys are going to see the little, you know, the little bohemian kind of like living room. Super, super duper and tiny um, and our little like, I love that though. I do like how the kitchen turned out. It's kind of like a little bistro area. <gasps> It's so cute and like the little corner eatery. It's like so romantical. <laughs> okay, so then we have the bathroom, which is so super modern, does not match, you know, the kitchen. It does not match the living room whatsoever. And it definitely does not match this room. I don't know, is this our party room? There's no beds. There's a little table and maybe it's where, you know, we become like a fortune teller. Maybe we just need like a room like that. I don't know. <laughs> okay, then we have the bedroom, which I feel like the bedroom and the kitchen could possibly be my favorite rooms in the home. I wish I had like more access to the clutter. I don't know. Maybe the challenge rules actually does say you can use like base game stuff. I don't know. But I tag all of you guys to attempt to do this challenge where every single room is a different pack. I will make sure to leave a link to the random pack generator down in the description. So if you guys do want to check it out, let me know how I did, how bad I did. And of course, make sure to give today's video a big thumbs up. And of course, make sure to subscribe with notifications. And hopefully I'm going to see you all next time. Bye guys.